just talking about, uh, uh, he was asking me whether or not it was me that found the hill that looked down on the base, and I told him that it was. And yes, indeed. I don't know if he's there. Are you there, Victor? Yes, I'm, I'm here. Uh, okay. Victor, um, might I ask then, uh, can you give us any physical details of the base itself? In other words, uh, what the hangars are like, uh, what the buildings are like, anything at all about Are you areas? referring to the Groom Dry Lake sure. facility or to S4? Um, either one that you're able to describe, actually. Well, um, uh, Groom, the Groom Dry Lake facility uh, has been broadcast uh, several times now on on, uh, on various programs, and uh, the... Uh, it, it, it is a relatively open facility in comparison to S4, um, which, as you may or I'm sure you do know, is, is uh, 10 miles to the south in uh, Papoos, uh, abutting Papoose Lake. Well, we have seen satellite uh, photographs of Area 51. Yes, yeah, this is the uh, this is the demise of Area 51. You're seeing the uh, the uh, open skies treaty. The uh, the uh, UFO tourism, which uh, Mr. Morton is a uh, is a big contributor um, to, and uh, the uh, also a certain psychological uh, effect, at least that's how I see it, uh, of the uh, Gulf War. When the uh, when the soldiers came back from the Gulf War, uh, uh, complaining of Gulf War syndrome, and this this uh, saturated the media. Uh, I, I believe this was uh, a direct. Um, cause of the uh, lawsuit of the various uh, Area 51 employees who claimed that they had been harmed by uh, the, the years of uh, fallout from uh, right. the nuclear testing. Uh, at any rate, all of these uh, all of these uh, uh, causes contributed to uh, what is now the uh, the case at, at Area 51, which is that the the uh, uh, saucer program and the uh, the uh, attempts at uh, communication with the beings and the facilities uh, for the beings are, are now uh, abandoned. All right. Um, uh, we, we've seen the photographs of what is above ground at uh, Area 51. I would be interested in any description of S4 or to know how much of Area 51 and or S4 is underground. Yes. Uh, nothing... Uh, significant is underground at the Groom Dry Lake facility. However, S4 has four underground levels, uh, uh -huh. or a total of five if you count the uh, surface. And uh, these are devoted to, um, are you able to describe what these levels are devoted to to any degree? The, the, uh, the first two levels uh, at, uh, at S4 are the uh, the uh, the domain of the uh, back engineering program uh, for the saucers, which I'm sure that uh, you're, you, you've heard all, you've heard your fill of from uh, Robert Lazar and others. You bet. Uh, level three and four, um, below the uh, 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 below level one and two, uh, uh, is the domain of the uh, the program uh, dealing with the EBEs. Can you? It, it includes the. By the way, uh, breathe, uh, breathe oxygen. Uh, during the during the chaos of the phone number, I uh, I heard a bit of your earlier program. I'm not sure if I uh, if I heard you correctly uh, uh, debating uh, what the what the aliens breathe. Uh, uh, they breathe oxygen. They they can walk uh, walk down any street in America and uh, huh. and uh, survive as well as they survive. Well, if that is the case, can you describe then the reason for the apparent seizure that that alien was having, or the reason that they die? Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. Uh, In other words, just handed me another note, and I, I would you repeat the question? Okay. Yes. Uh, sure. The question is, uh, if oxygen uh, is is common, if they yes. breathe as we do, then can you tell well, us that? I didn't say. I'm uh, again. This is the. Uh, this is one of the mysteries of the beings and their technology. Um, uh, did we did we finish? Uh, uh, did I finish my comment earlier about uh, 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 Schreiber's uh, uh, Schreiber's uh, um, comment about uh, about the telepathy? The, 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 the issue, or, or I'm sorry, about the uh, the, the microbes. They, to a certain extent, the beings appear to be.
be only symbolically biological. Now, uh, what I mean by that is they, uh, they, uh, when they're autopsy, they have the organs of a biological entity. They appear to function as a biological entity, but there is, uh, there is a, uh, there, there is a lack of the uh, chemical and physical functions one would expect in a biological entity, and uh, this has led uh, many individuals to consider them to be somehow uh, um, not uh, not quite physical. That they are that they are uh, somehow hallucinatory, no matter how physical they may appear to be. <laughs> but uh, another way of looking at it, and, and this relates to the uh, to their technology as well is to just simply say that we are not capable of understanding how they have evolved or how they have changed themselves in their in, in their own environment because uh, I mean think about it if you took a, a simple teenager's CD of today you know the the, the um, some some rock with the the Pink Floyd or or, or the Matching Pumpkins and you took that CD and uh, somehow transferred it back 100 years, there would be no science uh, on the face of the earth that would uh, uh, be able to uh, uh, tell you what that CD was for or how it operated. Yes, it would be. It would be as no evidence. It would be as magic. Um, that's a good point. Now, Victor, uh, this alien was in distress. Obviously, it was sick. Um, is there something on Earth that causes them? to have a shortened lifespan um, that you're aware of? This is the source of constant theories and no effective treatment. Um, it, 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 is, it, it is not... I do not believe that the aliens are, are dying because they cannot live in our environment. Um, I, I, frankly, I'm, I... I I don't want to make too many religious allusions, but uh, to to a certain extent, I uh, for some reason my mind keeps coming back to the uh, to the story of Jesus, which before this occurred, I did not uh, uh, believe to be uh, a a uh, historical fact. But at any rate, the, the certainly symbolically, it's applicable that uh, that the the Son of God would make himself vulnerable to to uh, to human uh, action when uh, obviously the Son of God would not be uh, in that uh, position. Uh, Victor, did you see any other natural condition? Sorry, did you did you see any other creatures being interviewed other than this one? I mean, on the video that you, you I did not personally see any other creatures, and I did not see any videotape of other species. I saw a videotape of a uh, of a uh, uh, of a being uh, of the same species, uh, another being, um, as uh, to the, uh, uh, frankly, uh, well, again, to, uh, I, I don't want to get into things that will that will tend to uh, narrow down my my participation uh, in, and, and make it more clear All right. where I fit into this. But but I'm I, I am not 100 percent uh, a believer in the the, the Pleiadian. Uh, Alien and the various other uh, the, the the more humanoid uh, the species. The uh, I believe they're wish fulfillment. Do we know where these particular aliens, this particular alien, is from? I believe they are from not here. I do not believe that they are necessarily from uh, the, the the far reaches of space, from uh, from say the reticuli, what have you. Um, I I the the. the um, very, various uh, science fiction writers and, and scientists have, uh, have postulated different forms of uh, alternate universes, and I don't believe there's really any scientific understanding of this phenomenon, but if I were to choose uh, a, 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 an answer to that question, I would say they come from another dimension. They come from uh, the, a contiguous place that is not uh, available to us, uh, whereas their their place and ours are, are, are equally available to them. Very informative. All right, what is the tone at Area 51? In other words, are they planning at some point, do you believe, to go public, release anything 